at the Louvre in Paris. We're looking at the Wedding at Cana, a very famous uh, painting uh, which depicts the first of uh, seven gospel miracles, namely uh, the transformation of water into wine. I've been invited to the Louvre in Paris. It is the biggest museum in the world, and we're here to look at the biggest painting in its collection. It's a painting that's been celebrated, torn, restored, threatened, mended, torn again, even duplicated. And now it's what the Mona Lisa is staring at. This is the Wedding Feast at Cana, painted by Paolo Veronese. It's a painting of Jesus' first miracle, turning water into wine, and it is massive. Six and a half meters wide, 10 meters high, including the frame, it weighs one and a half tons. It was commissioned by Benedictine monks in Venice in 1560. Paolo Cagliari, known as Paolo Veronese, was an Italian Renaissance painter based in Venice. Known for large format history paintings of religion and mythology, such as the wedding at Cana and the feast in the house of Levi, included with Titian, a generation older, and Tintoretto, a decade senior. Veronese of the great trio that dominated Venetian painting of the Cinquecento and the late Renaissance in the 16th century. On the third day, there was a marriage in Cana of Galilee. And it came to pass that all the wine was drunk. <laughs> and the mother of Jesus said unto the Lord, They have no more wine. <laughs> and Jesus said unto the servants, Fill six water pots with water. And they did so. And when the steward of the feast did taste of the water from the pots, it had become wine, and he knew not whence <laughs> it had come. 